grip requires the top hand to hold the stick firmly in the meat of the hand. A small knob at the top of the stick allows for a proper grip and better puck control. The V of the thumb and the first finger when gripping the stick align with the narrow side of the shaft. This will angle the blade for better puck control. The V alignment is the same for the bottom hand, but the grip is within the fingers. The bottom hand position will vary from close together for puck handling to farther apart for shooting. Beginning players When deciding on the length of a stick, a general rule is to stand in skates and measure the stick from the ice to the top of the sternum. Stick length is very important for skating development. With a long stick, a skater will bend at the waist and not the knees. The long stick will help a player stand up but prevents proper knee bend. With a shorter stick, a player bends the knees and has a good ready position. Length measured to the sternum, the beginner develops good knee bend for skating as well as puck feel. With a short stick, the hands are away from the body, which allow the elbows and wrist freedom to execute puck handling skills in all directions. With a stick of proper length, the angle of the blade or lie should be flat on the ice when in a ready position. Once the proper stick selection and length are determined, the beginning player must learn how to properly hold and carry the stick.